June 6, 1944. It's a day that lives in infamy as D-Day, or the invasion of Normandy. On this day, the Allied forces of Britain, America, and Canada attack German forces on the coast of Normandy, France. With a huge force of over 150,000 soldiers, the Allies attacked and gained a victory that became the turning point for World War II in Europe. Now, right here in mid-Missouri, the National Churchill Museum at Westminster College is honoring the 70th anniversary of D-Day in a unique way. The newest exhibit is called D-Day Normandy, Operation Overlord. It features the work of three U.S. Navy combat artists who traveled with the troops, sketching and painting their experiences at war. Dwight Shepler stayed on the ship and he has got a watercolor style that is uh, very delicate and yet very powerful. He's able to convey the power of the USS Arkansas that's laying fire in on German um, long-range batteries far off the beach. The other artist is Mitchell Jameson. He has got a sketch that's just very, very, very refined. And this is a scene um, of Omaha Beach and the soldiers here are dug in along the seawall. And this is Alexander Russo. He has a very gaunt person. He has very gaunt hands and facial features. He's got a very different look than the other two artists. These works of art beautifully capture the proud and terrifying moments that go along with being a soldier at war. Ryan Rumbaugh, KRCG 13 News, Fulton.